guys. So today we're going to be reading one of my favorite books. It's called The Pigeon Needs a Bath by Mo Willems. And he's saying, I do not. So here we go. We've got this man right here. He says, hi, I don't know if you've noticed, but the pigeon is filthy. So I could use your help because the pigeon needs a bath. And he's saying that is a matter of opinion. What a kidder. I don't really need a bath. I took one last month. I think it was last month. Scratch, scratch, scratch. Clean, dirty, they're just words, right? I feel clean. Maybe you need a bath. Yeah, when was the last time you had a bath? Oh, that's pretty recently. Life is so short. Why waste it on unimportant things? Like taking a bath. What smell? I don't smell anything. And if I do, it's a very normal smell for a pigeon. You know, in some places, it is impolite to bathe. All these flies buzzing around me are purely coincidental. Yuck, P.U., let's get out of here. Take a bath, dude. Okay, fine. So if it means so much to you, I'll take a bath. Whoa, I'm not going to like this one bit. Oh boy. <laughs> the water is too hot, too cold, too lukewarm, too hot, too wet, too cold, not enough toys, too many toys. Oh, now we're up here. Too deep. Not deep enough. Too cold. Now it's too hot again. Too reflective. That's still too hot. Well, I guess this is okay. Splash. Hey, this is fun. Wash, 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 wash. La, la, la. Singing in the tub. This is the life. I love bubbles. Look at my wrinkly toes. Hello? Hello. How are you? I'm fine. I'm a fish. I'm a fish. Ten hours later. Can I stay in the tub forever? The and I always tell my kids that usually at the end of a Mo Willems book, there's a pigeon. But since this one's about a pigeon, they have a hidden little duck. Can you find it? It's right there. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this book. And the rest of this week, we're going to be reading Pigeon Finds a Hot Dog and Pigeon Wants a Puppy. I really do. All right. Have a great rest of your day.